Okay, hello. <laughs> it's 01... 01.40 hours British summer time. It's a Thursday, it's the 5th of July 2018. And there's yet another mini Beano. This is MB07, the return to the doghouse Beano. Actually, it's not so much the return. It's actually open this time. So, plan. Sedgemore South, Dorchester and Weymouth. It rained overnight. It's all evaporated now. It's dry. There was a bit of a breeze, but it's stopped. It's nice and cool, and this is the best time to travel. My hopes? Costa Coffee is open in Sedgemore South. Anyway, to the end of the street, check in, scotch egg, pack the rest of the stuff, and we're off. Which is good. So, this is Sedgemore South. It's 3.24 hours. I don't know if it's misty or that smoky. Uh, anyway, it's over there. And the big question I have to ask myself is Costa Coffee open? <laughs> nice and cool here. Okay. Lots of resurfacing on the M5. Hard shoulder for quite some time. Not very well lit. Surprised there aren't more accidents. Anyway, coffee. Well, this is Dorchester. It's 10 to 6 in the morning. As regards the coffee, hmm. So there's a drive through from Costa Coffee at Sedgemore South. Closed. There were two actual branches, I suppose you'd call them, inside. Both closed. McDonald's coffee, which was fine and a lot cheaper. <laughs> uh, okay, so it's been semi foggy coming down here. That's the brewery square over there in the centre. That's the station, and the Premier Inn is just along past there and round the corner. And on the corner itself, Costa Coffee, which opens at six. So there will be bacon. I now need to stick a ticket on the car. Four quid. Yeah, could be worse. I think the mist has gone. I think the sun is out. And dependent on who you ask, I've got 19 or 22 max today. That's rather nice. <sighs> okay, five minutes early. And I don't open bar till nine. However, second cup of coffee, I think some water, and, and they're open, and uh, the World Cup, this is what a shot, W-O-T-T-E-R, from the Otter Brewery, 4% alcohol by volume, and our session ale. Ooh, it's a bit cold, hmm. I think there's a bit of citrus in here. Lemony, very lemony. Ah, bit malty, a bit sweet as well. That's quite nice. It's a bit different. B plus in a bit. Easily. Update. Just warmed up a bit now. Um, it's completely changed. It starts off with sweet maltiness and it goes off with a a gentle bit of finish. I haven't changed the rating, but wow. Got to serve at the right temperature. So, this is already out. And it doesn't mention any time. So, I'm going to aim for about 11 o'clock from the cubby, which will be 45 minutes after this. This is a jester by Green Jack Brewing from Lois Dock. 4.4% alcohol by volume and it says flavour, tropical fruit, bitter finish. Pale golden. Mm. Pale. No more golden. Oh, nearly a bit of spillage. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah, definitely. Um, 
not hugely fruity, but nicely fruity. And it is a gentle bit of finish. Mmm, very nice. Hang on, let's do it. One more. B plus in a bit. That is, that's not bad at all. Thank you, Lowestoft. There's a curry on order. Can you tell? Anyway, Shrewsbury, Salopian Brewery, um, Lemon Dream, 4.5% alcohol by volume, zesty. They say zesty next to the mango chutney. Oh, yes, it's zesty. Zesty and lemony and and refreshing and summery and D++. really like that. Oh, I can't wait for me. Um, um, chicken gel crazy. Hashtag Curry Thursday. Oh, here's a wonderful cooling breeze. And... So in the corner, sort of straight ahead, the blue painted building, and that's the Premier Inn. And the sun's gone behind a cloud and there's a breeze blowing and it's lovely. Anyway, Howling Hops, 6.9% alcohol by volume, New England Special IPA, whatever, something. Add a little sniff of the aroma. Very, very fruity. Full bodied, fruity, but blow your head off. B. <sighs> right, stay here, drink this, take it back to the bar, cross the road, get my stuff, and then check in. I have a plan. They say alley, I'd say lane. Anyway, it started to rain, I checked in. <sighs> it hammered down actually. Mostly on me, but here we are in this afternoon. Ooh. Yes. While I slowly steam in the corner, this is looking good. Wild weather ales, and the rain was a little bit wild for a while. Obscure 80s references. Sorry, reference, not references. 5% alcohol by volume, Simcoe Pale. This is going to be hockey. Mmm. Ooh. I think you would call that hop forward quite fruity, a little bit complex, not very really bitter but if you like it, which I do, I think it's great. B++. <laughs> uh, the alarm went off at um, half past midnight. I'm fatigued. Well, this one's labelled as Novachok free. Mm -hmm. uh, apparently no extra charge as well. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, Russian roulette, 4% alcohol by volume, by Downton. Smooth, balanced, and Novichok free. If I start foaming at the mouth. Thank you for answering my question earlier. I knew I'd heard it before. I didn't know what it meant. No, it's not bad actually. Malty, bitter. B plus in a bit. Yeah. 